Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install XAM on Kali Linux 2022. Open terminal. Let's verify whether this is Kali Linux 2022 or not. More slash etc os hyphen released. I am on Kali Linux and its version is 2022. Okay, <clears throat> now open Firefox. Then go to google.com. Now search for download XAMPP. Click on the first link that is apachefriends.org. Download XAMPP Apache Friends. See here. XAMPP is available for Windows, Linux and Mac OS X. So click on see the latest XAMPP version is 8.2.0 and its PHP version is 8.2.0. Click on this download 64 bit file. See new tab open but go to this previous tab. See, download has been started. See, download has been completed. Now go to terminal, then navigate to downloads type ls c we have xamp linux x64 8.2.0 hyphen 0 installer run see this is the file now we have to modify the permissions of this file chmod 7 double file then xam file name or run file. Hit enter. We have modified the file permissions. See here we have changed the file permission compared to this settings in this one. Now run the command sudo dot forward slash then xamp file xamp run file and hit enter. Then provide the password for root user. Not root user, it is sudo user. Click on this forward. Keep the checkbox as it is. Then click on forward. See, XAMPP will be installed on this opt slash lamp directory. Even if it is not there, this installation will be created. Then click on forward. Setup is ready to begin installing XAMPP on your computer. Click on this forward again. See, XAMPP installation has been started. See, click on finish. Now, go to this manager. Click on this manage service tab. 
See here, Apache Web Server is already started. If you want to start MySQL database, click on the start button. At present, I am not going to start. If you want to configure, click on this config. If you want to change the port for this Apache Web Server, then you need to change here like 8080 or anything. At present, I am not changing. Open config file. If you want to change the port also, here also you can change. See, reason 80, we want to change, change 80. Then save the file. But at present, I am not going to change anything. Then close this one. Cancel. Now open browser. Then, then type localhost 80c. We have successfully connected with connected to our web server. In case if you want to change port number 802 8080, then click on OK. Then click on Yes. So it is going to restart. Once restart is completed, See, restart is completed. Now, this won't work because we have changed the port. Refresh it and verify. See, it is not working. So, we have to give 8080. See, it's working. Again, I am going to change back it to 80. Click on OK. Click on S. Yes. Wait until it restarts again. Now, run again. Again, it won't work. So, give 80. Okay, it's working. Now, create a PHP file to run our first PHP program in XAMPP on Kali Linux. Go to terminal, navigate to install direct. That is slash opt lamp okay ls hyphen ldrh c these are the list of the files and folders in the zap installed direct now go to this ht docs cd ht docs ls hyphen ldrh c it has these files and folders now let's create a PHP file. Touch. Hello world. Dot PHP. You have to give sudo. See, hello world. Dot PHP file is created. You go to this one. We haven't received any output because that file is empty. Now modify this one vi hello world dot php. See this is read only file. See here this is read only file. So I am closing this one. Use sudo then vi. Then press i to insert mode. Echo. Welcome to after schools. Put the semicolon at the end of the statement again echo new line that is br echo 8 plus 9 then you must close this php tag escape and colon wq exclamation it will save the file you can verify Contents of the hello world again. See, given this PHP code or program. Now refresh the same file. See, the output has been displayed. This is the first line and this is the second line. If we add another line, echo. Welcome again.
Again, ref again we have to refresh to reflect the changes. See, we have added another content to the this page. So, in this video, we have seen how to download and install XAMPP on Kali Linux 2022. Then we have seen how to run, how to create and run a sample PHP program on Kali Linux. For more videos, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.